Hey everyone, so this is a spontaneous video today. It is one of the most requested videos that I do in the comment section and it is just blow dry a bob. So today I'm gonna to blow dry a bob. This is one of my clients, Sue. She's featured in another one of my videos that I'm refining her haircut, but let's get to it. So I'll start off with just sectioning off into a normal hot cross bun section. The products you can see there, Dream Blowout, I've got the Blonde Life Oil and I've got the Defy Damage Heat Shield. This is all gonna protect the hair from the heat and give it loads of moisture, proteins, shine, and just make it look really sparkly. You've seen the beginning pictures at the beginning of this video. So just sit along and watch as I blow dry Sue's hair. I'm using the Alpha Italia hair dryer, and I use a hair dryer on either a medium speed or a full speed. I always use full heat, uh, and I'm using the cold shot button a lot as well, just to set it into place. And what you'll see when I come to blow drying, uh, I'll talk it through as we go. So I'm just sectioning off this bottom piece here. I'm using the Alpha Italia hair dryer, as I said, and the Alpha Italia 43 round brush. And this is just, just to shape the hair. And what I really like to do is when I'm blow drying the shape into the hair using the brush and the blow dryer, is once the hair is dry, what I do is I just set it in shape and style it with the hair dryer. And I think this is something that became quite popular when Dyson released their hair dryer. And uh, it was more like a heat styler rather than a hair dryer. And they were promoting it more like that so you can style the hair with it. But I mean, I've done it all the way through, blow drying all the way through my hairdressing career where we put in the shape, we dry the shape, and then we just set it with either a little bit more heat or the cool shot, as everybody. But here's Natalie. Natalie's just having a look. She did a strand test on her client and she wants to go a sort of silver violet. So we're using the Joyco Quick Toners. Uh, back to blow drying. And again, just blow drying, normal round brush, just getting that heat all over there just to dry the section. As you can see Sue's hair, so it's naturally grey, um, quite a sort of curly texture I suppose but we can get it super smooth when blow drying. She just has a really nice tight bob, a little bit of graduation at the back but she likes the front to be that little bit shorter so there's a little bit of a, an, an, a decrease or increase of length, no a decrease of length at the front shall I say. It gets higher at the front around uh, the jawline, it just opens up her face a little bit more and then we're just going dry so again you can just see I'm just shaping it the haircut makes the shape of makes blow dry so so much easier because if you've got a good shape haircut in there it should just fall into place anyway Sue does need a haircut and there's a little bit of it around the hairline on the back that's just dropped a little bit so uh, in I think it's four weeks time she's got in we'll get that all neat and up and uh, nice and sharp for her again but you can see the haircut still holds its shape really well and I think this has been this was before Christmas, but this was cut well before Christmas. So um, yeah, it holds the shape really well. And for blow drying, it makes it super easy. So yeah, just still working with a full speed, full heat setting here. But I know that I've got full protection with Dream Blowout, the Defy Damage, and the oil. Oil is going to speed up blow, blow drying time. Same as the Dream Blowout, that's got um, an agent in it and ingredient in it that speeds up the blow drying time as well. But you can see just then I was sort of shaping the hair with the hair dryer. And that's really what I like to do. I like to get the hair dry and then smooth through and then just style it and set it into place with the hair dryer. Here we are on the other side, you can see in the mirror, I'm doing exactly the same. I'll be just blow drying all the way through. And if this video has been any help, let me know in the comments down below, guys. You can just check out the rest of it. But until next time, make sure if you are new, hit the subscribe button, give the video a thumbs up, and don't forget to comment down below. If you have made it this far, pop in, what emoji should we say? Pop in the, the blowing emoji. The one where it's like blowing wind or something like that. So, uh, so I know that you can get to the end of this video and if it, if it gave you any help, here's the final result. We're just smoothing through, just titillating it as we do as hairdressers. Um, and I'm just checking that hairline there, saying to Sue, right, when we, when we get you back in, booking in, we need to get it haircut. Finishing off with a bit of flip turn hairspray, and that is Sue ready to hit the town. Thank you so much, here's the end result and I look forward to seeing you on the next video.